Okay. Bird, 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 bird machine. Check. Hi guys, Del here. And for today's video, I'm going to be doing a YouTube survival slash beginner's guide to start your channel. So to begin with, you're going to need a camera. I recommend using a DSLR camera because they have amazing quality and they're really smooth. Sometimes when you bring in video footage from an, or an iPhone or a mobile device or whatever you use, it's kind of glitchy. So I would recommend using a Canon or a Nikon or whatever you have, but a DSLR. The one that I specifically use is a Canon EOS Rebel T5. Um, it's really cool. It works really well. I like it and I have an 18 to 55 millimeter lens. Uh, the only problem is that it doesn't have a flip out screen, which I think would be very helpful if you are looking to make videos. Because sometimes when I'm focusing, I have to wing it or I have to do multiple takes. If, so there was one time when I did a whole video and then I had to redo it because it wasn't in focus, which is kind of annoying. Or sometimes I have to have a family member see if it's in focus. The second thing is make sure you have an editing software that you're comfortable with and you understand how to use this. Comment below if you want a video on how to use iMovie and how to edit. The editing software that I use is iMovie and what I do for iMovie is I don't have Photoshop or anything like that too but I use this website called pickmonkey.com and basically it's a free online Photoshop or sort of editor and it works really well. I like it and I use it for all my titles and stuff because the iMovie titles are kind of generic and I don't um, personally use any of the Microsoft stuff so I don't know how that works but the one I use is iMovie and I think it works really well or sometimes if I'm doing special effects I'll use an, an app on my phone called Funimate and um, I'll apply effects to it okay so the next thing you are going to need is ideas ideas are key I don't know how many times I've been sitting in bed and I'm like oh my god I have an idea for a video so, what you need to do is keep a journal or notes on your phone or just a random piece of paper or post-its or like a whiteboard or anything. Anything to keep your notes and ideas organized for videos. Because you never know, one day you might want to record a video and you don't know what to do and then there you go, you got your ideas. That's all I use. I have on my phone, I have notebooks, I have pretty much everything for video ideas. Four, four things? The fourth thing that I think you must have for um, starting a YouTube channel is make sure make sure you plan out your videos ahead of time. This is so helpful. Like right now, I'm winging it, and I keep forgetting everything I'm about to say. Oh my God, I'm blinking. What was the other thing I was gonna say? Like this is too long of a video clip for like a five minute video, like barely five minutes. Make sure you plan out your video. If it's just like bullet points for saying what you need to say, like I need to add this, I need to add this. And maybe if you wanna crack a joke, put that joke in that little script setup organizer thing. It's like a storyboard for your video. You're just trying to lay out your ideas and frames and what you need to do. It's really helpful. The next thing that I think you're gonna need I mean, this is optional, like, personally, I don't have lighting or a microphone, but I just try and get it set up in a place where there's lots of lighting, and I try and speak louder, or try not to have anyone around me when I'm recording, so then it's quiet. You don't really need it. I mean, if you want it, you can get it, of course. And another thing you must know about if you're starting a YouTube channel is make sure when you're looking at music, you don't use popular music. You can use popular music. You have to use remixes that aren't copyrighted because if you use copyrighted music then and you're trying to make money, which is called monetization, you can't make money off of music that is copyrighted. Another thing is make your channel relatable. When you make your videos relatable, everybody is going to want to watch your channel. They're going to be able to see themselves in your shoes. Ooh, another thing, make sure you have a nice background <laughs> because nice backgrounds make for pretty much everything. Like, this background right now is pretty sick because, you know, it's Christmas and there's Christmas tree. So I, I like it a lot. I'm really feeling it, you know. So make sure there's a nice background. So that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I don't know how many tips that was. Please like and subscribe for more videos from me. And I'll see you, with, see you next week with another video. Bye.
bird, 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 bird machine. Check.